Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is CKT Chaotic. Today I will be reading Homesick episode 40, 41, and 42. Let's get started. Don't judge me. I have to do a disclaimer every other episode or every other videos. Um, just to let you guys know, I do read these webtoons just for fun. It is a way for me to, pr uh, to practice on my English pronunciation. Uh, English is my second language, as you guys can tell. I do have a slight Asian accent. My first language is Vietnamese. I am not sponsored in any sort of fashion from webtoons or any other sources out there. So purely i'm doing this out of pure enjoyment so please be kind and understanding that um sometimes my readings i do stutter but it is i'm working on it guys thank you so much for y'all's love and support and thank you so much for all the subscribers like i cannot believe i have over 500 subscribers oh, let's get started <sighs> You think he knows? They'll eventually know. Besides, you can't hide it from them forever. <clears throat> oh. Shit. I didn't even realize. Relax. No one knows it, noticed it, I think. I'll tell them when the time is right. There'll never be a right time. But do whatever you like. I'm tired. They'll disown me. I'm still here, aren't I? <sighs> Homesick. Stay here. I'll be right back. Sh uh, okay. Uh-uh. 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 Sam, they got baskets. Are you okay? Yeah, Kenny saved me just in time. Take it easy, I'll be fine. And he got hurt because of me, I really owe it to him. And you, are you okay? Are you kidding? I slept through the whole thing because of that. What? Forget it. I'm just glad you're both fine. <sighs> I'm sorry for what I said back at the house. I didn't mean to, mean to shut you out like that. Well, I did do it intentionally and that just because I didn't want you to, you know. Uh, I don't want you to see me as weak. I'm so sorry. If anyone's sorry, it should be me. You know, I regret ever making the stupid deal with you. I don't want you throwing your life away just to protect some guy who's barely done anything for you. You don't have to keep proving your worth to me because you're more than that. And I hope you realize it be without having me to tell you. Huh? Uh, what the fuck? You're not just some guy, Samuel. You were always there to help me whenever I needed it. You're caring, generous, but a little reckless sometimes, and that's okay. I'm reckless all the time. We'll just have to work on that part of ourselves together, but that's beside the point. What I'm trying to say is I'm not pushing myself to be worthy for you. Sure, maybe it was to return the favor at first, but I wanted to keep you safe because I care. So yeah, you're not just some guy. You're my friend. Uh. Phew. Making me say all that, all of that, I'm actually embarrassed. <laughs> <laughs> How do you think I feel? Thanks. Uh. I'll remember that. Tacky shirt, by the way. Hey, at least I found a shirt and a pair of slippers. I'm pretty damn lucky if you ask me. Mm. 
Homesick. What was that glare for? What is- what are those? Medicine? <laughs> He's glaring too. Oh, oh. Uh, I'm sorry about Navin. Don't worry about it. I don't want to talk about it. Please. Sorry. I'll begin now. Don't force yourself to stitch up my leg. I can do it myself. No. Let me help. It's the least that I can do. Thanks, Tomaha. What? I said, is there anything you want for your birthday? <gasps> Are you getting me a birthday gift? <laughs> Got anything in mind? I want to go to the beach. There aren't any beaches around here. Then I want a car. Mm, how about a girlfriend? Uh, hold on. I'm gonna go fetch Tomaha real quick. Wait, 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 wait. I'm just kidding. Please don't. <clears throat> what do I want? There's some. There is something, but it would be too selfish of me. What is it? Peace? No stress? No worries? Just peace? A long, quiet sleep without any disturbance? And if possible, I want to see my brother again. I don't- I didn't know you have a brother. I never really thought of bringing him up, so... There were complications, and then one thing led to the other. He ran away searching for solitude. I just miss him so much. I hope you find him. <laughs> it's decided. We're going to the beach. Ah, wait, what? Yeah, we can sneak out, grab some drinks, and have the best day of our lives. You wally. What about work? What about... Navy, just don't think about it and let me take care of it, okay? A decent beach that's anxiety-free, just the two of us. <laughs> what did you say? Kenny, boss looking for you. Alright, I'm coming. I'll talk to you later, Navy. Kenny? What's up? I'm glad we met. What was that? I didn't hear ya. <laughs> I said I'm glad I met you. Why are you being weird? <laughs> you kept me going when I had nothing. Okay. It's done. How are you feeling? Kenny? It should have been me. Not him. Navin was still young. He had so much to live for. And yet, why did he... Why? We even promised to celebrate his birthday together. Navin was never planning to make it past 18. After his brother took his own life, he wasn't able to move on because he blamed himself for his brother's death. It tore him apart. But Navin promised himself, he promised that he, when he reached adulthood, he would go and see him. Huh. What happened to him is never anyone's fault. Navin wants to make sure you understand that. He also wants you to know that for the past 18 years of his life, he finally felt at peace. Everything he told me confused me because I had no idea. But I know even before he closed his eyes, he was thinking about you. Homesick. What happened? We need to go. Why? The place is secure. Besides, everyone's tired. Still, we need. We should keep go. Keep moving. I have a really bad feeling about this place. Rain. Wait. What's the rush? We barely got here, and you already want to leave? 
No, you don't understand. We have to go. Now. Huh? No, wait. Sorry. I didn't mean to. Uh. Huh? What is that? Something's off. I'm, I'm aware of... I'm well aware of that. The problem is I have no idea what it is and when it will attack. No, rain. Focus. It is not coming from the woods. Huh? Huh? Shit. What is that? What is that? What is that? Oh, the eyes! <sighs> oh my gosh. <gasps> Kenny, gun! <sighs> Bang! Click, click, click. Fuck! What's wrong? We're out of elm ammo! Y'all okay? Who is this now? <laughs> Who the hell are you? That's rude. Did your mom not teach you manners? What's that? It's a kid? He's a little girl. <laughs> sorry, sorry about that. He's a little cranky today. Put me down. I'm Valencia. You can call me Val. This is Leo. Leo? Leo. Leo. I'm gonna say Leo. Did, did I say something weird? They're not reacting at all. They're probably taken off guard, or maybe because you talk too fast. Ah, uh, I'm Rain. Thanks for saving us. Are you two infected? <laughs> nah. W would we be carrying weapons if we were? Look, my nails are normal. Completely normal. Were y'all watching us? Well, that's crazy. Why would we? We were. We had to make sure the people we needed, we needed help from is not a threat to us. I hope you understand. Fair enough. What do you guys need help with? We were supposed to be back home about an hour ago, but we crashed our bike. <laughs> but... At this rate, it's gonna take forever to get back. Home? Are there others? Yeah, there are people waiting for us. That's why we're wondering if you could give us a ride? We can't help you. No offense, but you're not giving us enough reasons to trust you both. I'm sorry. What? But we... Val? <clears throat> we understand. Thanks anyways. Come on, let's go. Wait, but Lyle... Kenny, we have to look out for ourselves. It's better this way. We have, we have space for two more. Sammy, what are you? But if you two try anything, I won't hesitate to kill you. Are we clear? If it makes you feeling better, we'll leave our weapons under your, your care. It's only fair. I appreciate it. Sammy, what the hell are you thinking? What if they're trying to lure us to some place shady? I don't trust them. But I think it's safe to give them the benefit of the doubt. You gotta be kidding me. You realize how much risk you're putting us in? Kenny. I agree with Sam. We should just see how it goes and... <sighs> For now, we'll keep our guards up. Alright guys, that is a wrap. Honestly, I don't know how I feel about them meeting new people because every time they meet new people, they have to go through the whole vax, you know, application of seeing if this person is actually a good person or not. But I like the new character. Val is, uh, Val is very pretty. <laughs> I'm just saying. Alright guys, if you guys enjoy my webtoon reaction slash reading style, feel free to subscribe, leave a thumbs up, and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!